how to create a free landing page with ConvertKit. I'm gonna show you how to set up your new account and create your first landing page in under three minutes so that you can start building your email list and making money. If you watch this video all the way to the end, I'll give you a free landing page template that you can use inside ConvertKit. Let's jump onto my laptop and start building your landing page. The first thing we need to do is create a new account for you. So head down to the link just below the like button. That's gonna take you across to ConvertKit. You can sign up for a new account and then you'll be inside the ConvertKit dashboard. We're gonna head up to grow and we're gonna head on to landing pages. And we're gonna head over to the right hand side and click on this create new. Now we have two options. We can create a form or we can create a landing page. We're going to do a landing page. Okay, choose the template that you want. And now we're gonna start customizing our template. First thing I want you to do is rename the landing page so that you don't get confused between other landing pages at a later date. Then we're going to update the title. We're going to center our text. You can add your own image. We're going to upload a YouTube logo now we're going to change the big image so we're going to replace it with our book cover now the background doesn't suit we want this to stand out so we're going to have to go and edit the background we delete that background change the background color our simple color we don't want anything distracting we want our main focus to be on the front i'm going to copy that because we want this pattern to disappear i'm just going to do the same color there no pattern on the background so you want everything on your landing page to be super simple don't over complicate everything you want it to be linear so if the person landing on the landing page isn't distracted by anything they know they're here to get your free guide or course and all they need to do is put the email and then they can get access to your course and that's all you want to do keep it super linear so no distractions here you don't need anything to explain there you can have two or three points that explain the benefits of the guide or the course and you can do that by adding bullet points here so you can add three points there and we've got three secrets that we share in the course that'll help people get the results that they're looking for and then they can add the email address i like to add a field here and change the field to first name so that we get first name and email and I'll put that above the email. This is just a nice addition that you can then customize your email to be addressed to their first name. So when they are receiving emails from you, it feels a lot more personalized and it helps build that relationship with your customer. Then I want you to change the text on the button. I don't want it to say sign up, but it must be a call to action. It's really important to make sure the button is a call to action, displaying the benefit that the person is getting by clicking. Not what you're getting, this is about your customer and how you can help them. So make sure all of the text that you're using communicates the benefit that they are going to get. And we can change this color. We're going to change it closer to that YouTube red so that it matches everything on our landing page. Now we need to head up to the settings and we're going to choose what the subscribers see once they have clicked that. So the success messages, now check your email to confirm your subscription. You can change this to read anything you want. Then the incentive is the email. So you can edit the email contents. What are they going to get? when they click on here. So we don't want to confirm your subscription, we want it to be about their benefit. Same again here, this button must be get access to the course. It's small tweaks in the email, but it's really important that you customize the email so that it makes sense to the person that's signing up and it fulfills the promise that you had on your landing page. So once you're done there, click on save and then you can link it to your custom domain name and then click on save. Make sure you click on save in the top right and you can preview it by clicking on the preview button to see what it's gonna look like. Once you're happy with that preview of your landing page, you can click on publish and then you can copy the link. And this link is what you're going to send to your customers to sign up or put in the description of your YouTube video. So we can paste it in and just check what the preview looks like to make sure it's displaying exactly how it did in the preview. Now make sure you check this on mobile as well so you know how it looks. And that's how you create a landing page inside of ConvertKit. Don't forget, I've got that free template for you. I'll leave the link just below the like button. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions about building an email list, let us know in the comment section down below and we'll see you in the next video.